Bring the statue of, back. I want this mother back. Instead of instead of fighting against each other, we need to unify us. Any way we can get together as a community, support each other, instead of fighting against each other, promoting this as opposed to that, instead of something to unify us. Native American, something, something from the community steel mills that unified this community at one time, made it one of the strongest communities in the city. We need to start thinking that way. Something to unify us instead of tearing us apart. Right. So what, what would you say to people? So some people online have been saying, oh, this isn't an issue, it doesn't matter. Uh, what would you say to people that say that? Well, it matters to some people. It bothered some people enough that they came out and said it should come down. I mean, it's been happening throughout the community, throughout the city. It bothered some people, and it bothered a lot of people. And so I believe that the uh, majority of people, you know, thought that it should come down. I was taught that Columbus was, you know, the, the founder of the United States of America. I was told one line of history, which I believe was a falsehood. There were no talks about it. The only, the only black person I heard about in history was Booker T. Washington. He's the only one. What happened to all these other people that discovered things, that invented things? Black people, brown people. Those people are never mentioned when I was going to school in history. So I think, you know, it took a death, a murder of a person that, you know, had no right to be treated that way. And it took his death to wake up a whole country. And uh, may he rest in peace. And uh, I look at a guy like John Lewis, Congressman Lewis, who his whole life he was vilified and beaten, but all he talked about was love and togetherness. We need to start thinking like John Lewis thought. We need to start bringing this country together. And hopefully people will get out and vote this November. <laughs> and we need to bring this country back. I've never, I've been here 68 years, and the country, I've never seen the country so torn apart and so in, in, in turmoil. And hopefully, that'll change this after November. We need to do it. To say